Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to compress or resize your video without losing your video quality using Win HD Video Converter Deluxe. Okay, so this is a great software for those of you who want to compress a large video file to make it smaller so that you can insert it in your PowerPoint slide or you can send it to email or upload it to YouTube, Facebook or Instagram or stuff like that. With this software, you can also convert MOV file to MP4 without losing video quality too. And if you want to try the software, go ahead to the link in the description or you can go to their official website, winxdvd.com. I tried the software for about a week and found out many advantages of the software, such as its super fast conversion speed with level 3 hardware acceleration. You can reserve the original quality using high quality engine and deinterlacing engine making video up to 90% smaller with advanced compression kernel and HEVC codec support. Added to that, you can also convert among MP4, MOV, MKV, AVI, HEVC, H264 AVI, uh, and many other video formats. You can also edit, cut, merge, crop video, and extract screenshot and audio with the program too. If you want to learn more about the product, you can just check out the description of the product on the main website. And then you want to click here to download free trial version. All right, so once you install the software, this is the user interface of the software. In order to compress your video, all you need to do is to click here at this video option. Okay, and then you can select a video on your computer. For example, I have this video. It is 4.81 gigabyte, which is 15 minute video. Okay, just select it. Uh, by the way, you can select multiple video if you want, okay? But I'm going to select only this video and let's click open. Alright, and the next thing you want to do is to select the output profile. They have different profile. For example, you can just click here at the general profile. Uh, we have 4K video, 2K video, MP4 video, and MOV video. Uh, for example, this is an MOV video and I want to convert it to MP4 and compress the file to make it smaller. So we can select this option, MP4 video. And on the right side, you have three options for the video quality. The first one is low quality, medium quality, and high quality. But when you select high quality video, the conversion speed will be slower. For this example, I want to compress the video but uh, keep the video quality. So I'm going to select medium quality right here. And then I can click OK. OK, and if you want to see more profile setting, you want to click here at this gear icon. Just click here and you can see that this is the video codec and the frame rate or stuff like that. We can just select the frame rate and select keep origin if you don't want to change the frame rate of the video. Okay, and the resolution also. Okay, and if you want to convert multiple video, you can just click this button, apply to all. Okay, for now I can just click OK. And the next thing, you want to select the destination folder on your computer. For example, this is the destination folder on my computer. If I want to change it, I can just click this button, browse, and then I can create a new folder maybe on my computer. By the way, I will just leave it by default, so I'm going to click cancel. And on the right side, you can preview your video, select hardware accelerator. And you can also check this box to merge the video if you have multiple video right here. By the way, you can just click this button, run to start the conversion. Okay, just click here. And now the software will compress this video to make a smaller file. Two hours later. Okay, and the conversion is finished and this is the final result. And this is my MP4 file, which is only 730 megabyte in comparison with 4.8 gigabyte. And to be honest, when I see the compressed video, I cannot recognize the original one and the compressed one. And here's the compressed one, and on the left side is the original video. I, I don't see the difference, but when I check the file, the bitrate number of the compressed video is smaller than the original one. Alright, so this is how to reduce your video file without losing your video quality using WinX HD Video Converter Deluxe. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. And if you want to try the software, go ahead to the link in the description. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye!